deep breaths deep breaths not to relax deep breaths because i'm having an ongoing panic attack my head is light i don't feel right i feel sick not just mentally sick but physically sick vomiting up nothing that sounds funny but it's not because i am nothing i feel nothing or maybe i feel too much but i just don't care anymore because no one wants to listen or maybe it's not me, it's because my ma and my dad, they can't see my vision. I laugh out of disbelief. You have to put your head down in school, my ma said. But I've been putting my head down too much lately, out of grief. Da, da doesn't understand. What's, What's wrong, wrong with you? With Get you up out of bed. bed. He doesn't know why I'm like this, he said. Ma thinks of anger issues because I hit the wall last night. I didn't want to hit it, it just happened. I actually end up laughing, laughing because I'm hurting myself without asking. It's getting worse. I know it is. I need help. Months go by and I keep asking, why, why, why? Why me? I didn't ask for this life. It sucks to be me and it wasn't my choice. I wouldn't even let my worst enemy go through this pain. I'm getting help now. The doctor referred me to a counsellor. He said, kid, you don't have anger issues, so stop crying and wipe your eyes. Your self-harmony said, which is pretty alarming. Self-harming is no Prince Charming. You cope all alone. You don't scream or shout. It's your own unique way of letting pain out. It's a problem. So speak up, cause it's your life. And in the blink of an eye, it can go out of sight. So stand tall and say I'm happy to be me. And if you ever need help, reach out for yourself. And you do what's best for your mental health. You change. Now I've found someone that has walked the same road, who I trust and confide in and who helps me offload. That one solid person that helps show me the way and who picks me back up when I'm not feeling okay. Whatever your fight, don't fight it on your own. You can always get help. You are never alone.